Local elections are close now, and in the capital, some local boroughs have interesting choices at the ballot box. Two candidates from borough chief are much younger than the average local leader. In Taipei, Luo Zhiyou is doing his best to win voters' hearts by demonstrating his energy and problem-solving talents. Meanwhile, 23-year-old Li Pingjun wants to give younger people more opportunities to shine. We chatted with two of the capital's youngest aspiring leaders. White shirt, gelled hair, strong brow, large eyes, double eyelids. He could be an entertainment industry idol. But no, it's a candidate for borough chief in Xinyi district. Luo Ziyou has already won fans online, but winning votes on the ground is more tough. To be honest, at first the older ladies I would talk to at the vegetable market weren't very open to me. They thought I was too young. I think that gradually over time we were very hardworking and we went there every day and chatted to them and asked what their needs were and that touched them. It seems a handsome young man doesn't get an easy ride with the housewife demographic. People really care about the service the local borough leader will offer. <laughs> but over time, Law says he has won more support by regularly visiting the markets and strolling the streets. He was born in the 80s and has worked as a retail agent. This is his first time running for election. When my neighbor has a leak or too much junk piled up in the basement, I go and find some information to see how other people deal with it. So if I run into a similar situation, I can think of a way to help solve it. And I tell people to give a newcomer a chance. The main thing is to show that I'm full of energy. And while Xin Yi considers law, in Nangang there's an even younger candidate. Tall and slender, with delicate face and a mane of long hair. The Encheng Borough Chief candidate Li Pingjun is just 23 years old. She previously worked in the Electoral Services Office of Taipei City Council at Li Mingxian and learned how tough campaigns can be while fighting on Li's behalf. Even on rainy days, she's out talking to voters on the street. The residents of the borough are very passionate. When I go out to talk to people for a few days, it increases my confidence. People have been quite open-minded towards me. We're ready for a new generation to step up. I hope to give more opportunities to young people. Lee is winning hearts and minds, and the electoral freebies are also going down well. In this post-pandemic age, a little package containing a mask is the obvious choice for a local election memento. These young candidates are doing their best to demonstrate their dedication and potential in a field that traditionally can be hard to break into.